Hey guys, I'm back again with another algorithm less uh, solution for the 4x4. This was requested a lot in my last algorithm list video. So, this is the corner swap parity issue that sometimes comes up on the 4x4. You'll see here that we have two corners are correct and two are not correct, which means you can't solve this cube the way you normally would with a 3x3. So, what we need to do is swap these. So, this is actually a pretty simple algorithm. It's only six steps. And it's only on two layers of the cube, so it's actually really easy. You don't even really have to move your left hand. So what we're going to do is um, it's all 180 degree moves, so it's going to be this inner layer 180 degrees, this top layer 180 degrees, and then this the top two layers 180 degrees. So it's very simple. It's two. It's a lot of 180s. So it's six steps. So what we're going to do is I'm going to walk you through that. So we're going to move this inner right layer. 180 degrees, so there's 180 degrees. Then we're going to move the top layer 180. We're going to move that inner right layer again 180 degrees. The top layer 180 degrees. And this inner right layer 180 degrees one more time. And then lastly, we spin the top to make all the reds line up. And that's it. Now, it doesn't look like we really did anything. In fact, it looks like we probably messed it up a little bit more. What we really did was reposition the, these corners, and now we need to resolve this top layer. So the first thing we'll, we'll need to notice is that the sides are no longer solved. So we're going to go ahead, and I'm just going to solve those real quick. I'm assuming if you're watching this video, you already know how to do that. So now the red is solved, the yellow is solved. Oh, we still don't have these other layers, so let me do that real quick. Okay, so now we have all the sides solved, and you'll notice it looks like only one of the corners is in the correct spot, this red, yellow, blue corner. So we solve the corners. Oh, we didn't quite get it that time, so we'll do it one more time. Oh, wow, we got lucky that time. And you'll notice that uh, all the corners are in the correct spots. Normally, you don't end up with a completely solved cube after that. Normally, you end up with corners that need to be flipped, and you do that last algorithm. But it's really a pretty simple algorithm, assuming you know how to do the other parts to move the sides and to reposition the corners. But again, if you're watching this video, I'm almost positive you already are past that stage. So all you need to do is you need to start out with a cube that has two incorrect sides here and two correct sides on the back. So just remember to start with the incorrect corners facing you and it's two up, the top two, two up, the top two layers, inner right two again, and then finally the top two layers and then you just resolve the top. It's actually pretty simple. All right, if you guys have any questions or anything on any other videos you want me to post, I'd be happy to do it. Thanks a lot.